Yo, yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Thank you for showing out, bringing the energy and bringing the, the vibes to the channel. I appreciate you guys and if you're new, my name is Jeroy. So for today's exciting video, what I'm gonna be showing you guys is my Sunday active recovery day. You guys know how much I love fitness, health, taking care of myself, investing into myself, and part of that is recovering. I do a lot of training throughout the week, so I wanna make sure that I take care of my body so that going into the new week, I feel fresh, I feel good. So I just actually got back from a two mile walk with my dog, Leia. It was a great walk, very sunny day. I had a great walk, as you guys can see, I still have my headphones on because I like to get some tunes bumping on my walk. And if you look over here, Leia is knocked out. She's clearly had enough walking for the day. I mean, my six, six tall behind and her short little legs, that's a full on workout. Active recovery is self explanatory, guys. You're being active, you're working on your mobility. A lot of us work really hard throughout the week, nine to five jobs, just hustling, grinding, working every single day. So you wanna invest into yourself, take care of your body. It's so important so that you can keep going. You can do regular recovery where you get in the tub, you do some Epsom salt, or you get in the tub, you get some ice, or maybe you meditate like me and you just zen out and lights your sage, whatever you gotta do, but today's active recovery. So I already started with my walk, and now I'm gonna be going to the gym to do a stretching and mobility routine because that is so important to me. Head over to the gym, do some breathing exercises, do some stretching, and then head back to the crib. And you guys are gonna be joining me today because y'all are the fam, right? See you guys over there. All right, y'all made it to the gym ready for this routine. And remember, when you do your active recovery, it can be so many different things. It could be a light jog, it could be a run, you could be going swimming, you could do Pilates, you can do yoga, you could do so many different things. But today, I'm gonna be doing something called a Ram Wad. Now, my coach actually put me onto this when I was doing his program, and it's a recovery routine, it's a recovery website, and they have literally over 1,500 different routines that you could do to take care of your body, whether you're just a regular person day to day, or you're an athlete. I want you guys to take a look at this right real quick because I am at the basketball court and I can honestly cry right now because this basketball court where I used to do so much training at has turned into a cycling class. Like, and they took down the nets. It's upsetting, man. But we're gonna enjoy this routine. You guys can follow along if you want. Save this, make sure to drop a like, guys. It really helps the channel grow. While going through this routine, something that is so important to me on a Sunday is making sure that I'm drinking lots of water, vegan water, however you get it. You wanna drink lots of water, guys, because it's gonna make you feel so much better going into the week, especially to start your Monday. You gotta hydrate the body. You gotta fuel the body to keep the mind sharp. mats now but what I'm about to do next guys is the downward dog make sure you stretch your arms out nice and far in front of you and release some tension from the back upper back middle back lower back all that good stuff this is one of my favorite ones to do in my morning routine let's get it
Peace and love, always fam. Back at the crib, as you guys can see from my active recovery session. Now, whenever I go into my active recovery session, typically on Sundays, I'll do it fasted. Now, for those of you that don't know what fasting is, there's so many different fasts you can do. The fast I did is all I did was drink some vegan water. You gotta feel the body to keep the mind sharp, okay? I didn't eat any food. I went into the stretching and mobility session on an empty stomach because when I'm doing that, I wanna feel one with myself. I wanna feel light, I wanna have a clear mind, and you guys know when you eat a lot of food, you just feel bloated, you can, uh, so many different things can go on when you eat a lot of freaking food. But now, since I did that, it's time to eat, of course, okay? This is like my trophy, this is my NBA championship. I'm gonna enjoy myself a nice big breakfast. That's like my favorite meal of the day. And whenever I eat breakfast, I always like to eat a lot because that way I don't have to think too much about eating throughout the day. I got so much nutrients in early in the morning, okay? I'm still gonna eat throughout the day, but breakfast is like the staple. If you're training hard, you gotta get those calories in. So, about to enjoy myself a bomb breakfast, you know what I'm saying? We in Jeroy's kitchen. I'm about to throw down, baby, let's go. Y'all can call me Chef Roy, short for Joe Roy. You see how I just took the Roy and you put the chef in front of it? Chef Roy, super smooth. We got this big breakfast right here. I am playing no games. Let me tell you guys what I got from left to right. So first, right here on the left, we have OJ. No Simpson, you already know the vibes. We got a fruit cup right here of some pineapples. Ladies love pineapples, especially when guys eat them, if you know what I mean. Then, right here on this beautiful plate we have right here, we have avocado chopped, some pepper, some salt, mm, healthy fats, fibers. Right in the middle, we got potatoes, seasoned potatoes, okay, pepper, Himalayan salt, um, Cajun seasoning. We have an egg right here, two eggs, two egg whites. We got red, red bell peppers, green bell peppers. We got some vegan cheese. We got some tofurkey in there, right, extra protein. And then on the right side, we have two pieces of Dave Killer's bread toast with some strawberry chai jelly. Muhammad Ali say, the champ is here. So I'm gonna enjoy all this while diving into a podcast. So excited, oh my God. Well fam, wrapping up today's video, I hope y'all enjoyed. I hope you were able to grab some value from today's video. Make sure to drop a like, guys, if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. And also click the bell next to the subscribe button, guys. That way you get notified when new videos drop. I drop new videos every single week, and a lot of you guys are subscribed, love the videos, but you don't have notifications on. So click the bell and make sure you turn it on always. And do not forget to always work on yourself. Invest into yourself, man. That is the best project you'll ever work on. Just like a car, our cars need tune-up, you know what I'm saying? Otherwise, we're not gonna be able to keep moving forward. It's the same thing with your body. You need a tune-up, so whether it's a stretch, mobility routine, or some active recovery, always make sure to take care of yourself, because if you're not taking care of yourself, you can't help anybody else, okay? And also, too, enjoy yourself a big, big breakfast every once in a while, for real. But thank you so much for making it to the end, and family, y'all know what it is, man. Make sure to comment E and D in the comment section. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. And as always, stay true to self. Never be turning around, never be turning around, never be slowing it down, never be slowing it down, ayy. I keep my foot on the gas, I keep my foot on the gas, ayy.